hey guys welcome to the channel what's good i hope you are doing well this is hp lesser mfp 135w 1350 to be precise this printer is dope stuff multifunctional printing gear full features lesser printing entry level printing price it's very affordable wireless multitask this printer is using 106A toner. If you check my video, you see how we loaded the toner cartridges. We connected this printer to Wi-Fi network. This printer is dual band, right? Is Wi-Fi and also USB cable connection. I'm going to turn this printer around, show you some of the features. Then we we'll go from there to load the paper tray and also print out the alignment page for this printer. Right, I'm going to turn this printer around, right? From the back here, okay, from the back here, the power cable goes right here. If you check my videos, you see how we unbox this printer. So this printer got power cable, UK use and European use, right? So right now we look, connected the, this printer to power cable. The USB cable is spot goes right here. So you stick the USB cable. I want to mention we have the USB cable at Vinetex store. Check out Vinetex store for USB cable. It's tested. Free delivery here from UK. Free delivery from United Kingdom. You can also send it abroad, but the delivery charge is included. So go to the website at Vinetex store, okay? And support us, right? I want to also so the part number and detail for this printer is right here okay if you need to speak to the hp I'm going to turn this print around okay turn it around here is the scanner for this printer so you can load various paper on top of the scanner then you select the function and you are good to go this button here okay is for wi-fi if you check my video we loaded this we connected this wi-fi network right now is steady blue light to show you that it's connected to Wi-Fi, but when it's flashing, okay, it means that it's not connected. This light that is flashing right now is telling us that the paper tray is not loaded. Okay, I want to show you some of the features. Bring in the camera close for you to see. Okay, so this printer, you turn this printer off and on from right here. This is the on and off button. Okay, here is for you to select the job you want to do. Okay, so this is copy or scan button this is for you to cancel okay so this is for you to select the function this is go go back arrow okay you select this to select how many copies of the document you want okay if you see can look it's changing okay so you go back to particular copy so you can can print out up to 99 pages of document right here so once you select that you press ok okay so this is to go back arrow now it's telling us paper empty okay paper empty okay right now this is wi-fi okay this is also can see for you to increase the quality dark or normal right now it's still clear the quality of the paper okay this is for you to ready to scan scan to dw so this is to, for you to scan okay this button here Okay, so this is for you to go back. Okay, so this button here is to scan. Okay, what I want to then if you select the, any function, so you press this to cancel. Okay, now I want to show you also the toner for this printer. Okay, so to open up this printer, I just need to pull it up this way. You need to pull up. This is how to open it up. Okay, just pull it up and the paper. Okay, pull this up, okay, and open. The toner is right here. To remove the toner, you just need to hold it and go back. Pull it out, okay. If you check my videos, we loaded the toner. You check my video how we did it. For you to load the toner, you just need to, there's the two hook here. You just need to go in the first one. This one needs to go in first. Okay, and also there's a line here, arrow to show you that you just need to go in. But before we do that, there's also a yellow plastic 
that was here that covering the image so you just need to remove that plastic and you go in okay once you go in follow the pattern you will hear a click sound so this is how to load the toner okay right now what i want us to do is basically load the paper trail for us to load the paper trail okay you open it up right here okay so here is the paper trail then okay just gonna close this down so load the paper tray you just need to choose the particular paper you want to load okay and pull it this is for you to pull it close you need to hold this together okay so you need to hold it together and be able to move okay and once you remove your hand then it will, it will stay to the particular paper you are using so i'm going to get an a4 paper for us to load and we'll go from there paper so with this you can load up to can print out up to 99 pages of documents right here okay so you can print out up to 99 pages of documents so what you need to do is go in depending on this is a4 paper depending on depending on document you want to load okay so you go in straight okay Okay, so here it is. Okay, so you go in, okay, and use this arrow to hold it together. Okay, so right now it's A4 paper. Okay, and initially you will see a yellow light was flashing here. Right now you recognize this paper we loaded. Okay, you just bring this out. Okay, so that the paper will rest on top of it. Right now this recognize the paper we loaded. Okay, so right now. If you see this printer is telling us right now ready to copy okay so this is how to load your paper tray you can see it's telling us ready to copy so once you stick the document on top of this scanner you are ready to go okay so this is beautiful stuff very nice compact gear okay and also the other thing i want to show you is for you to complete the alignment page for this printer okay we need to go to the app okay so go to hp smart app you can see this printer setup completed so if you want to print any page or document you select print page for instance skip from the app you have the option to so send the link to other printing device not right now this is tutorial okay right now it's it was telling us paper out but it's telling us right now printer is ready so you can see so this printer right now is ready okay this printer right now is ready if you want to print the alignment page you just need to click the printer okay once you select, click, click the printer then you have the option of for you to check printers report okay advanced information okay so i think what i saw found that you can print the alignment because this is laser okay so if it's in toner then but from what we can see here the option is not here for but this is where to check if you need to print alignment but also this printer information it will tell you about the printer information right here okay network information if you select network information then it also tell you about network information tell you wireless is on connect status and also tell you the network name and details okay and also wi-fi direct is on security wi-fi direct password okay so right now this printer is this is how to load this printer uh the the paper tray okay if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe okay there is no um there's there's no option for us to print alignment head for this because it's a toner because it's lesser jet okay lesser printer okay but if it's ordinary other printer like lesser jet or inject printer then it will actually give you the option ask you to print and complete the alignment head okay but that option is not required 
with lesser printers okay so right now we connected this printer to wi-fi network load the paper tray and this printer is ready to go check out my next video i'm going to show you how to scan your document if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it helps us to grow thank you